say good morning. We're back for the second week of things that you can do at home. Uh, and we encourage everybody to stay fit, to stay healthy, and be active. Uh, I am the varsity coach at Solon High School, boys and girls. And I'd like to introduce Joe as well. Joe Dizer, JV coach. We're going to start off this morning by reviewing some of our warm-up exercises. Remember we do the helicopter back and forth. All these exercises are meant to get you loosened up, nothing real crazy. Uh, and we want to bend over, touch the knees, touch the toes, reach up as high as you can. Real easily do a couple jumping jacks, three or four jumping jacks. Uh, some lunges, real easy, across the basement floor, one, two, three, four. Practice with your racket. Make the strokes nice and easy. Stay out of the way of your mother's lamp. Forehand, notice that I, as I come through, I'm perpendicular in contact, back and finish. On the backhand, racket back two-handed, perpendicular in contact, over the shoulder, nice and easy, nice and fluid. Okay, some basic warm-ups on the volley, step and punch, forehand volley. Backhand volley, ready for the overhead. We'll talk about the serve a little later. Okay, and now we have, we want to encourage you to get your friends involved, get on Facebook, take a look at all the things we have available to you. And now I'm going to turn this over to Coach Frederick. He's going to show you some of the uh, facilities we use for conditioning. So uh, the few things that I want to share first is that how to improve while at home. Uh, make sure when you practice tennis, you have a racket in your hand. That's key. Work on your technique. Shadow your stroke, and that sounds funny, but shadow your stroke in front of a mirror so you can see yourself. Uh, you got to do the right racket pattern, like Joe just mentioned. Going down through the forehand, for the backhand, etc. Volleys and serve. Work on your footwork with your racket again. Uh, vis uh, visualization, uh, that is to maybe watch some videos online and see how professional players play, how they construct point, how they make decisions on the court at the right time with the right ball. Work on your toss and like Joe said, go on YouTube, watch some videos of professional players that train. There's uh, uh, everything from uh, girls, uh, ladies tennis to men's tennis. You have Tiem working out, you have Djokovic uh, working out. You have, um, ah, what's her name? Uh, I forget the name. Um, Steffi Graf. Steffi Graf. <laughs> but, well, yeah, Steffi yeah, Graf is exactly. a good example right. because she has an amazing footwork. Steffi Graf, look, look her up. So anyway, what I brought today is some props. This is something, if you do not have the hurdles, you can use anything you want at home. You can use a, ga a gallon of milk because I'm sure you've been stocking it, if not toilet paper. All right, jump over the toilet paper. So you can do things like this, sideways. You can do things with two feet. There's a lot of things on YouTube that you can do. You can do, obviously, the ladder, and you can actually do your ladder at home if you use some chalk. Let me just remove this. So you can do different things, like this, for example. And there's, there's exercises on YouTube. You can do one leg, and you keep your balance. This is not so easy, because tennis is a balanced sport. Uh, you can do the typewriter, in and out. Just like that. This is just a few examples. Now, if you have a, a ball suit, that is great. This is probably the best thing you can do for tennis because you have to push off with your outer foot. So here it is. And here again, you gotta keep balance. Just like that. There's a lot of things you can do with a ball suit. Back to this one here. 
You have the bands. Now this is good. This is the best thing you can do for tennis to get stronger because tennis is repetition. You can do things like this. You can do things like this. You can do things like this. You can do these things like this for your forehand. You can come around, just like throwing a ball. So these are some of the again what you can do with the band. And of course, on YouTube, you have things that you can do with the band. Weights, don't use heavy weights for tennis. Go through the motion, pronate, come around. Make sure you bounce the ball, come around, and work on that elbow motion. Serving is all about the elbow. Get your elbow back and come around. Okay? Then we have, there's a coach down in Florida who says you have to do this 2,000 times a day if you want to be good. Okay? So that's another thing you can do at home. Remember the cones of last week? You had two cones. This week you have three cones. You can go around here, sideways, there, or you can go frontways. Make sure you have happy feet. Okay? Now the other segment I have here is two cones that are well separated. Not separated even more. This is about your crossover step. The fastest way to get back to the middle from the sides is a crossover step there Crossover back. Crossover back. Crossover back. If you do not do this, this will not get you anywhere. I'll pass it on to Joe. Okay, coach, great job. Lots of great uh, technique. Uh, I want to finish up with just some easy forehands to target here. Coach put a line on the wall with a target, so I'm going to take the softball, nice and easy. Try to hit the target here, keep it going. Nice and easy, four hands, with those feet in position, try to find the target. Much better, much better to make the target than to blast it. So I can hit the ball harder, and then I can move around and hit my back Shades, boom, forehand, backhand, forehand, backhand. What a great workout this would be. You've got a lot of energy, and, and uh, this is a great place to utilize it. And thank you very much for your time. We hope to see you on Facebook. Bring your friends. Thank you. And maybe you want to introduce the summer program. Yes, you take it away. I take, take it away. I was going to do some serves actually from here. You can do the serves on the target as well. This is exciting. I'm not going to hit Joe. There we go. I missed it. I missed it again. So that's what you can do on the wall. And if you miss, it's okay. You keep working at it. There, I'm getting the target. That's it. Work on that elbow. So, yes, we do have a summer camp. We have, if I recall, seven weeks of summer camps. Please sign up. I think uh, this summer, if it gets off the ground, will be very, very uh, busy. Uh, so make sure you get your place on, on our courts. And uh, that's it. The other thing I wanted to mention, you know, maybe that's something to say. You can play with the football as well. This is the American family of the football. This is great for the serve. No better motion than the throwing motion for every sport. Also, too, you can just throw the ball back and forth. What a great, what a great exercise.
exercise. You can bounce it back and forth. Uh, we want you to remember that tennis is a lifetime sport. We want to get you involved this summer, and we want you to spend a lifetime at tennis. Lots of great exercises, a great environment. We also want you to uh, play on the Solon tennis team. We have the coaches here, so we're recruiting you now. Let's go. Again, we encourage you to, to stay fit, to stay positive, to be healthy, and uh, we look forward to seeing you this summer. Thank you.